All right, friends. Let us start off with question number nine. Messrs. A wants to import an equipment from Japan at a cost of three thousand four hundred lakhs. So I'll write down yen payable. This is working note number one. Basic data. Yen payable. Everyone, tell me how much is the yen payable? Three thousand four hundred lakhs. A company may avail loan at how much percent per annum? Eighteen percent per annum. Eighteen percent per annum with quarterly rest, with which it can import the said equipment. So this is going at what rest? It is going at quarterly rest. The company has also an offer from Osaka branch, so it's a it's a Japan loan, including extending a credit of one eighty days at two percent. So credit period in Japan is how many days? One hundred and eighty days. All right. At how much percent rate of interest? Two percent. Interest rate is two percent per annum. All right, against LC. So there will be some LC charges. LC commission is given below. How much is that given? It is given as two percent per twelve months. Fine. So they have given the spot rate also. Spot rate will be what? Three forty yen per hundred rupees. That is how they have given, and they have also given the forward rate. Am I right? What is the forward rate? Three forty-five yen per hundred rupees. I'll give you a minute. Just absorb this basic data. Amount payable is three thousand four hundred lakh. Then you have interest at eighteen percent per annum quarterly rest. Credit period in Japan is one eighty days. Two percent per annum is the interest, and the LC commission is given. So basically, he has got two options from what I understand. Option one: take the loan only in India. Option number two: take the loan in US. Not US, sorry. Take the your loan in yen. Any one option is available to him. So shall we start with the first one now? Okay. <coughs> Working note number two. Analysis of option of loan in India. Everyone interact with me now. Tell me what is the total amount required? Three thousand four hundred lakh yen. What is the spot rate that is given in the question? Three forty. So tell me from this how much will be your loan in India? Three thousand four hundred lakh yen divided by three forty into hundred. Can someone tell me the amount? Do you get the answer as thousand lakhs, friends? Now on this, the interest is on quarterly rest. So interest first quarter that would be thousand lakhs into I think eighteen percent per annum means it will be four point five percent for the first quarter. Am I right? So how much is thousand into four point five percent? Do you get the answer as forty five lakhs? Okay. Now interest second quarter that would be one zero four five into four point five percent. Do you get the answer as forty seven point zero two five lakhs? Total. Loan to be repaid. So tell me here, how much will be the total loan repaid? One zero nine two point zero two five. I'll give you one minute. Just read and understand this part.
I believe you are clear with this part. Can I go to the next one now? Yes. Perfect. Some of you please keep talking in between, okay? I feel like I am writing an exam right now. Okay. Yes, sir. All clear, right? Yes, sir. Okay, okay. Then we'll go to the next working note. What is the next working note? We are going to repay yen loan. Okay. So now tell me what will be the loan amount over here? It will be three thousand four hundred lakh yen. On that, how much is the interest they have told in the question? Two percent. On LC one eighty days is what they have told, correct? So the formula would be three thousand four hundred into two percent into one eighty divided by three sixty five. You would get the number as thirty three point five three lakh yen. Okay. So what is the closing amount that is payable over here? Three four three three point five three. Lakh yen will be closing amount. All right. So once you get this closing amount, the next point that I am going to do over here is I will take the forward rate. How much will be the forward rate? Three forty five yen for every hundred rupee. Correct. So what I will do is three four three three point five three divided by three forty five. If I do, I will get the amount. Payable over here as nine point nine five two. Oh, sorry, I have to multiply with hundred. Nine ninety five point two two point two two lakh rupees. Friends, this is only part one. We have one more part. Why do we have one more part? Because we have to pay the LC commission now. Okay, so I'll just go and write down over here the next step. Step number two. LC commission. Now everyone, tell me what have they told about the LC commission? Two percent for twelve months, correct? So LC is basically what, friends? LC is paid in India. I hope you are clear with that. LC is basically a guarantee money that the Indian bank is going to collect, and they are going to give a guarantee to the Japan bank that tomorrow, if this fellow runs away, I will pay the money on behalf of this fellow. So LC is paid in India. So today. Three thousand four hundred lakh on that two percent for twelve months, correct? So that would be we are taking this money for how many months? I think six months only, right? So that will be one percent for one year, one eighty days, that six months, correct? This will turn out to be how much? Three thousand four hundred into two percent into six by twelve. So I think we'll get the answer as thirty-four lakh yen. Now this will be divided by three forty yen into hundred rupees. Do I get the answer as ten lakh rupees? This is my commission that I should pay today. But friends, will I be paying this money today? No, I will pay all the money after six months. So on this, what will I have to do? I will have to add interest for how many months? Six months. So when you add interest for six months, it will be ten lakhs into nine percentage. That is eighteen percentage for six by twelve. Do I get the answer as point nine zero lakh? And my amount payable over here will turn out to be how much? Ten point nine zero lakhs. Friends, this is how your RTP has done it. That's why I'm doing it like this. Ideally, this also should have been on quarterly rest. So I just give in bracket. Ideally. This should also be on quarterly rest. Are you all clear with this part now, friends? Okay. Ideally, but they haven't done it like that. So once I get this, I can give the conclusion. I'll give a heading over here. I will have to pay ten point nine lakhs. Along with this, I have to pay nine ninety five point two two lakhs. Do you get the answer as one zero zero six point one two lakhs? Now tell me, friends, which is better? 
1006 is better or 1092 is better come on tell me you can unmute and speak 1006 better or 1092 better here you have to pay 1092 here you have to pay only 1006 so which is better this is the better answer everybody clear with this part if you are done with this we are done with this question also